I purchased a $200 Pokemon mystery box from the dollar store. Welcome to Family Dollar. The booster packs inside this mystery box could contain any of the ones shown on screen. And with 36 packs inside of that mystery box, I'm hoping we could find some treasure. Let's get started with our first pack. Whoa, what is this? Do not display, do not sell until 2 4 2022. Okay, so this hasn't been released this year, obviously. Let's see what we got. And I'm actually giving away two elite trainer boxes to two lucky winners here in the Poke Cave. Head to the giveaway, just number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, down below in the comment section, let me know how you think we're going to do in today's video. All right, it's in a Ziploc bag. That's pretty uh, legit, I got to say. All right. <laughs> It's kind of weird. It's in a Ziploc bag. Um, but, oh, we do have Brilliant Star. So, I think on the first actual, like, they come in quantities of six. I bought a bunch of these, so they should all be different, hopefully. But it, I think all six of these are going to be Brilliant Stars. It looked like there's some different promo cards in them, though. So, let's uh, open this one up and see what we got. Obviously, we get our pack. We get our code card. We got this really nice Eevee Black Star promo. And then it looks like we do have a big coin. Oh, we got Venusaur on this one. All right, let's open up our first booster pack. I'm hoping that we could actually get some cool stuff. I mean, Brilliant Stars is a nice set to get out of here, but hopefully we could get other sets as well. I know that I have basically six different shots at different booster packs here, so hopefully they don't just give us all the same set. That that would be pretty bad. We have... Oh! Actually pulled the goods first back! Whimsicott V-Star Rainbow! Not gonna lie, I kinda wish that that was the Charizard, but we'll, we'll be alright. Alright, the next pack looks like we just have a different promo card. Everything else should be the same. We got a Flapple right there. All right, Charizard artwork on our next booster back. So do you think we're going to get some older stuff from maybe like Sun and Moon, X and Y era, or even some other Sword and Shield era sets? Boom, but we are getting hits. Mimikyu VMAX. Nice. And I have all the packs ready to go. But I actually have a Venusaur and I have a promo card overload. So I want to give all these away to one person that follows me on Instagram. So just click the link down below and I will DM the winner within seven days of this video. All right, so, and we'll just go straight through these. We'll go straight through them. Piplup. We got, dang, we're crushing it. Octillery and a worm. All right, next booster bag. Now, the question is, after we open up these three, are we going to get a different set? Are we going to get a different? Bro, I don't even care. I'll keep this. Oh, my God. This is nuts. Arceus, full art V card hit. We cannot stop today. Yo, sometimes you just have those days. Just have those days sometimes. I don't know what it is. We got the fire hands today. Luck is with us. Luck is with us. Let's get, uh, what's that, five? Let's get five in a row. Let's get five in a row. Okay, we're not going to get five in a row. That's fine. Then we got one more Brilliant Stars, and then we're going to open up our next random bag of booster packs. Let's see what we get. Mm, okay, nothing in that. Next one. Do not, oh, no. Is this going to be the same? Oh, no, no, no. Don't do me like that. I mean, I'll keep, I, I guess I'll take it because it's going to be some nice pull rates, hopefully. Oh, we got the same. We got the same. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. We'll, we'll do it again. We'll do it again. And we have them all opened up, ready to go. I'm not going to make you guys watch me open up all of these every time. All right, let's start with our first pack. Can we continue the luck that we... Well, we, we had the luck for the first four packs, but can we get back to the luck is the question. And I have the answer. Answer no. The answer's, the answer's no. Okay, that's fine. Next pack of Brilliant Stars. So 36 packs in total out of this mystery box here. Um, oh, oh, upside down Magmar. Doesn't mean anything, though. Because we didn't get anything in that pack. Pull rates should be good on this set. I mean, you saw in the first four, but uh, what's happening now? What is happening now? Pack number four. Come on, Purloin. I think I see something. Oh, we're back, baby. Sylvia V. Trainer Gallery. That's fine. That's all we need. This is actually the most valuable card that we pulled so far today. Brilliant Stars is just the best to open up. If you want to get pulls, you open up Brilliant Stars. If you want to get really nice stuff, you open up Brilliant Stars. Okay, not that bad. What do you think? Do you, would you guys buy these mystery things from Family Dollar? A big old box of mystery packs. Oh, nothing here, nothing here. Moving on to our next one. Oh, we're switching it up. Okay, we got Fusion Strike. It is about time, ladies and gentlemen. We have a different set. I mean, it's still Sword and Shield Arrow, but, I mean, it's something different. Get our code card. We got a different promo card. We got Tepig this time. And instead of a Jumbo coin, we have a regular Suicune coin. All right, let's see what we get out of our first booster pack. So this is actually good because I still need to pull those nice Gengar and Mew cards out of here one of these days. Hopefully today's the day. And then we got another one so you can see on there we got a Blitzel promo card. All right, I prepped everything out, so we're good to go. Let's get it going here. Second booster pack of Fusion Strike. Brilliant Stars, we're doing good. Let's see if Fusion Strike can do better. See, the problem with Fusion Strike is we don't have a subset. We don't have another subset like the Trainer Gallery. The pull rates are going to be tougher. I mean, it's just how it is. This is how it's going to be. Inteleon V. Mm, three more booster packs here. Can we get a different set after this is the question. Can we get a different set after this fusion strike? 
Luxray. And it's just tougher. It's just tougher. Come on. Next pack, next pack, next pack. Quillfish. Uh, uh, oh, uh, Mew V, regular V card. All right, I want something better than a V, though. I need something better than a V. Here we go. Eevee, Shelter, Voltorb, Luxray, nah. Next one's gonna be another Fusion Strike. Actually, I can open up these ones pretty quick. The Brilliant Stars ones are tougher to open for some reason. So, this actually works out pretty good. I, I get the promo cards and the coins out afterwards. All right, so, the big question is, do you think you can actually get older generations and older sets from this list? Or is this one of those things where they're just gonna give you the most modern stuff? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Some of these places are tricky. Some of these places are tricky. They're like, oh, mystery packs. And then they just give you the latest set. But they charge more. See, that's the thing, that you pay for more because it's a mystery. But what if they're all literally just the newest set? We got Deoxys in there. Oh, we can't get anything from Fusion today. Are we going to have to do a big fusion strike opening? I think we're going to have to do a big fusion strike opening. I'm sorry. I think we're going to have to do a big fusion. Because now, 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 no. Now I'm just frustrated with fusion strike. I'm just completely, yeah, no. I think we might have to go back to that at another day. Okay. We are back to, fu uh, not fusion, brilliant stars, which is fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yo, this is super random, but the corners are really sharp on these. I actually thought I cut myself a couple times opening these up. That's actually really sharp. So after these packs, I have one more thing of booster packs. So hopefully we can end it with something pretty cool. Here's another code card. I don't know. These code cards are just everywhere. So technically, you do get two code cards when you buy these things. It's kind of cool. Ugh. What happened to our beginning luck? Beginning of this video, we were just crushing. It's a rude regular V card. We lost our luck somewhere. Somewhere along the way. So what do you guys think of these now? What are you thinking now? What are we thinking? I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to do this again. Because I actually, I did do a different Family Dollar video. It was the same thing, but it had different. It was sleeve packs instead of these. And actually, the sleeve packs, I think I had most were Sword and Shield base, but then I did have a little bit of Rebel Clash, but I think that was it. So these are actually completely different sets. All right, the last one in this mystery box. What's it going to be? Oh, I think I see it. Oh, I can tell from this. Oh, brilliant stars. So we had four quantities of brilliant stars, and then we had two quant. Why is this? Uh, I don't know what happened. And then two quantities of fusion. All right. So to save this video, I'm going to need an alternate artwork Charizard or a rainbow Charizard or something real cool from these last packs. I think if we can end it on something like that, I'll be cool. The odds of that happening... Not the highest. My daughter actually pulled the Rainbow Charizard today for Brilliant Stars out of one pack. One pack. I'm telling you, she's lucky. Semi Seer V, one single pack. That's it. And then the Rainbow Charizard. Just like, just like nothing. So maybe, maybe we could do that. <laughs> we got the Charizard V. Nice. Okay, we got something. Something. Okay, get us warmed up with the Charizard V. Then hit the home run. Last two packs. Oh, destroyed that. Okay. Okay. Come on. Come on. All dust nor regular hollow. All right, Charizard. Ending this video out. Not the worst. I don't know. We had the best luck in the beginning. Ended it with an Agron V Max pull. All right, but that is going to do it. I probably won't be doing that again because I don't know if I'm going to be spending money for just the most recent set. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to smash the like button. Also, feel free to click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day, and I will see you on the next one.